Evan was a graduate of Malvern Prep who lost his fight with osteogenic sarcoma on September 21, 2005. Lacrosse was a very large part of Evan's life. He was diagnosed with bone cancer on September 11, 2001 and told he would no longer be able to play lacrosse. For any other teenager, this would have been devastating news. But for Evan, this was just a bump in the road of his life. He seized this moment to embrace lacrosse and became a coach and mentor for his friends and teammates. Malvern Prep and the greater Philadelphia lacrosse communities were huge supporters of Evan, both spiritually and financially, motivating him to fight every day of his life. In honor of Evan's spirit and will to overcome life's greatest obstacle, Malvern Prep will host an annual youth lacrosse festival, EvanFest. Today, many families in our local communities are faced with realities of dealing with hardships as a result of a child's unexpected illness. All proceeds from EvanFest will be donated to families whose child is battling a life-threatening illness. I am doing my part for EvanFest as well. I started quarterback for a cause when one of my close friends and lifelong teammates, Evan Brady, passed away my senior year of high school. As quarterback for the Red Devils, I have the opportunity to throw the ball as well as run with it. I hope that people will consider a financial pledge for every yard I gain throughout the season. For example, last season, I threw for 2,000 yards and ran for another 750. If you were to donate one cent per yard, at the end of the season, you would donate $27.50 to EvanFest. This year in total, I was able to raise almost $22,000. I am doing my part for EvanFest, and I hope I can inspire others to do the same. EvanFest has helped 38 families in counting in honor of Evan's legacy. An EvanFest recipient, John, has shared his heartwarming story of perseverance, which was inspired through the generosity of EvanFest. This is his personal statement. Everyone involved with EvanFest are a model of true goodness and charity. Even though we were complete strangers, they heard my story and reached out to help. They were relentless in their willingness to assist in any way. The support from the Bradys went far beyond the monetary. Not knowing what to expect, having just been diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, they willingly shared their story of Evan's life and fight with cancer. They were there every step of the way, to listen and to give advice about how to deal with everything I was being hit with. It is incredible to have people like them in the world. Cancer is a very real and serious disease that affects everyone, whether you've had it or not. What we need is people like the Bradys and those involved with EvanFest, whose goal is not only to bring an end to cancer, but enrich the lives of those that struggle with it, along with their family and friends. I really can't thank them enough for all they did for me and for what they continue to do for others. I will never forget them. Through various philanthropic events, EvanFest has been able to raise a significant amount of money. However, for EvanFest to have a sustained impact on people's lives, they need your support. Buying t-shirts and bracelets, attending the tournament, and other various events in support of EvanFest are integral parts of raising awareness and continuing the legacy of Evan Brady.